I, I, I mean, it's, it's been life, right. It's been life changing for us. Absolutely life changing. You know, to be part of a show that's touched so many people is a real gift, and it's been, you know, a highlight of my life for sure. And it's sad that it's all coming to an end now, but we're glad that we're here celebrating it. Oh yes, the pilot. I'd never read anything like it. It's still new. It's still refreshing. It's still magical. And it was just nice to see a story at that time that featured so many strong character women. Right answer. It, but it's true. It's true. And to see that on TV and for kids to see that, if I had to, even for our sons or if we had girls, I think it would be such an empowering thing to see women like that on television. <laughs> I mean, uh, we're professional, embarrass our selfers. Yeah, um, I've blocked them all out after <laughs> seven years. I've blocked those out. I just get hurt a lot. Like, we did get yeah. to the point, especially during my pregnancies, where the crew would kind of act as bubble wrap around me because I, I like to, I like to face plant. Mm -hmm. I like to fall over. I'll trip over anything. I mean, I always, I've told this story before, but I always go back to, I had to ride. Oh, that's right. A, a dragon is what we saw on screen, but what, in reality, it was this this big giant pickle. mechanical pickle. It was a pickle. Was a pickle. I had to ride a pickle. A big plastic, green plastic yeah. pickle. Yeah. We have talked again and again about how lucky we have been that our co-stars, every scene partner has been so strong every step of the way. Everyone's been such a blessing, such a solid actor, such an addition to the cast. I agree, I agree, you know, and it's a testament to Eddie and Adam's writing and the creation of Once Upon a Time that it attracted so many great actors to be part of it. So if it wasn't for their writing and their storytelling, we wouldn't have these brilliant actors wanting to be part of Once Upon a Time.